I'm Humphrey Rang. I'm an emeritus retired professor of pharmacology at University College, London. I'm Graham Henderson. I'm professor of pharmacology at the University of Bristol. My old tutor, um, Heinz Schild, whom I mentioned before, um, had been for a good many years uh, co-author of a classical pharmacology textbook originally uh, written by A.J. Clarke and published the first edition in 1931 and Schilt had uh, taken it through successive editions. He, was, he felt that he wanted to hand it over and he asked me uh, to take it on which I was very happy to do and in the event uh, we didn't continue with the the, the series of the, of the existing textbook we decided to start again from scratch. had a lot of excellent things in it which we've made use of uh, but uh, we, we undertook a pretty radical revision at that time. I'm a recent recruit to the Rang and Dale authors. I've only been a, an author of the seventh and now the eighth editions and uh, I was just absolutely delighted when Humphrey asked me to, if I would uh, contribute to uh, Rang and Dale uh, because it's such a super textbook and I'd used it for a long time teaching and uh, the idea of being part of it was just uh, very exciting. I would say it's written at a very, in a very nice style. It's very easy to read, it's very well laid out but also it's a bit of fun. There are a lot of uh, little footnotes uh, and I know my students really enjoy them um, but at the same time it's full of very good science and it mixes how drugs work with how drugs um, act in, in the human body and how patients will experience effects and side effects. So it goes right across uh, the, the, the whole part of pharmacology for each drug. Oh, really for undergraduate students and well I guess um, in um, this country where medical education is, is a postgraduate exercise then for uh, for medical students in general in their preclinical years. In, in Bristol we use it extensively both for medical teaching, dental teaching and veterinary teaching but also for our science students it gives them a very good grounding in how drugs work in the body. What I hope they take away is an interest and an understanding of the importance of mechanisms of, of drug action as opposed to simple descriptions of their uh, effects in man and animals. Our understanding mechanism is absolutely crucial to making sense of pharmacology, so that's one key message. And th the other thing I or another thing that I hope they will take away is that it's a continuously uh, evolving subject that changes all the time, that um, what we're writing now will probably uh, be out of date in a few years' time and uh, it's a need to, to keep up all the time. So I hope they'll, they'll take away um, parts of the book that, that explain things we don't know and still need to know so predicting advances that are likely to come uh, in future years. I was astonished at how popular it became, how quickly, um, because when you, you sit down and you spend long hours, weekends, evenings and so on, uh, writing away, it's quite a lonely exercise and you really don't know uh, how it's going to be received and it was a tremendous surprise and delight that it, it became accepted very quickly. I've just been surprised at how much I've learned in writing the book that uh, you have to do your research and you think you know a little bit about drugs but then when you start to investigate them you realise there's a, a lot more information out there. So for me it's been a great learning experience.